Here you are, ladies and gentlemen. It's about that time. It's about that time. You know, this game is coming out next week, and I'm so excited to play this game. I cannot wait for the full release happen. And when it does happen, when the full release of this game happen, I'm going to be so excited because it's one of those games I was interested to play in 2024. Same with the other game that came in 2024. Well, I'll play that later on. But this game is coming out next week. I have to play it. it it's a must play for me to play with, uh, you know, the games coming out next week. If you don't know what the game is, what it's called, it's called Stellar Blade. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Antoine here. Back in the video. We're back with another video on the channel. In today's video, we're here to play Stellar Blade, which uh, is the demo version. So the, the game is not released yet. It's going to release in next week. Next Friday, as I'm recording this on Friday, it's going to be released next Friday. And I'm so excited for that one, man, because I cannot wait for this game to come out. I'm immediately going to play this game, attack head on. Um, I, I don't know if it's going to have a, a easy difficulty, normal difficulty, or hard difficulty. I don't know what difficulty going to be is. But regardless, if it, if it does not have a hard difficulty, whatever, whatsoever, in the game just for fun, whatever, I'll, I'll play with you for this if I have to, you know what I'm saying? But if it has a hard difficulty in, in this game, then no fucking thank you. But um, that's nor here, that's nor there. Uh, Stellar Blade, playing the demo version. I, I did install the demo version uh, as, yes, as of yesterday because I want to play this game and give the game a try and see how it is. And um, I, have, I have watched one YouTuber's, you know, uh, 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 gameplay of it. His name is uh, Hollow. I'm a huge fan of Hollow. Uh, he played the uh, demo version of Stellar Blade. I was like, hmm, let me let me see what this game is all about. You know what I'm saying? Because uh, one thing, if you, if you guys don't know, I'm a huge fan when it comes to action pack, you know, slash adventures games. And also, um, well, let's just say, you know, the thumbnail of you know, the, you, you know, the thumbnail. <laughs> That's another thing I'm a fan of. But, you know, hey, hey, don't judge me for it. I mean, it's not like you've seen it before or you were a fan of it too as well. Like, don't 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 act like you didn't see it, whatever. But anyway, besides that though, um, yeah, man, Stellar Blade. It looks like an interesting game. This was announced in the uh the Game Awards back in uh 2023 around, I think around December, yes, December. And I was I was interested in this game. I was wondering, okay, this game is pretty interesting. You know what I'm saying? At first, I was like, I wasn't sure sure if I want to play any 2024 games because they're so interesting. Then I discovered two games I was interested in that I want to play for 2024. That's in 2024. That's the 2024 games, which is this one, Stellar Blade, but also the other one that I plan on doing a series on probably after Stellar Blade. So, yeah, but, um, um yeah, I mean, I, I cannot wait for this game to come out because I'm going to be playing it. I've already pre-ordered the game. Yeah, I, I'm a sucker to pre-ordering. I know. I, I normally don't pre-order games because I don't know if it's going to be buggy or laggy and shit. I don't know what the hell is going to happen and shit. But, you know, doesn't matter. So, shit. <laughs> I just want to play it, you know what I'm saying, and, and get my hands on it because it's an action-slash-adventure games. I love uh, action-slash-adventure games. I love horror games. I love any kind of games in genre as long as they know puzzle bullshit. But other than that, though, I, 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 I can tell from the hype of everybody who's playing this game it's going to be very interesting, and I cannot wait to play it. It's going to be so awesome. Um, unfortunately, unfortunately, some of you guys probably wonder, because it's a one-player, two-player, it's a one-player game. And also, unfortunately, it's a Sony uh, exclusive game. So for all the Xbox and PC fan fans out there, um, for all the PC and the Xbox, Xbox fans out there, unfortunately, you guys will not be able to play it uh, still, Blade, because it's only exclusive to Sony, which means it's only exclusive to PlayStation. Unfortunately, which I I really wish that at some point Sony would and and Microsoft would start. I, I get the competition and all that type of stuff, but can y'all just be brothers and shake your hand and just say let's work on the game together, or or have this have this exclusive game go to the other exclusive platform, like something like that. I don't know, man, because I, I this war between PlayStation and Xbox is annoying as hell. But you know what? It, it won't end because you know it's a competition one or the other. Competition watch. And I have no problem with gaming competition. A competition in general because at the end of the day we win because we get better games you know what i'm saying but um yeah but anyway besides that though man uh still blade demo i cannot wait to play this game um this is gonna be very awesome like i said i've already pre-ordered the game so you guys can see me play it immediately when this game come out it comes out next friday unfortunately people are going to get sponsored by playstation they're going to have the uh, early access to the game so 
But I'm not going to watch it. I'm not going to do any of that. I'm not going to spoil myself to even watch the people channels because I pre-ordered the game. I wanted to play this game head on, see how it is. Uh, if it's possible for me to even play a trophy for the game, you know what I'm saying? If it is, if it doesn't have a hard difficulty, difficulty and all type of shit, then I will play a trophy for it. I wouldn't mind. I'm still playing trophy hunting if you guys don't know, but it's just I'm um, I'm taking a slow back to it because I'm trying to do the gameplay walkthroughs and other content on the channel. Um, you know, you know what I'm saying? And then you know I'm saying once I get those done, I'll go back to playing trophy hunting for, for now. But right now, um, I'm just slowly trying to just do gameplay walkthroughs and the other stuff on the other content on the channel, you know, saying shorts and other things, but you know what I'm saying? Um but yeah, I mean, uh, this can be very interesting, man. Um, I cannot wait for this game to come out. Once again, I know I've said that multiple times, but this game's gonna be awesome. Oh, and just to clarify things real quick, um, the settings, of course, everything I gotta show you guys in the settings. Uh, they have a, a lengthy, they have a, a a ponytail length to where you could like you could you know make Eve's a ponytail, um, you know, uh, long and short. Now, if you know who Eve is, Eve is is this uh main character. Have robot, have uh, have human girl that that comes from wherever she came from to the Earth to save Earth for mankind. Basically, this game is about like, a girl named Eve, who's the only one that's left from the from their her, her kind to save Earth by defeating these aliens that has taken over Earth. So basically, play as Eve. We slay these aliens, save the world, save Earth, and boom. Yeah, that's basically what the game is. Just just some short, just summarize the whole short things of the game. I will be saying it again when the full game comes out, so the way the so the way people could understand it a bit more. It's just a little short thing I want to talk about. This this is the demo because anything could change in the demo, whatever. I did play a demo of Resident Evil uh, Four, I believe, when they made the remake or demo when they made the demo, the Chainsaw demo, pretty fun. Um, you know, what I'm saying it did re really well with the video. Let's see if this demo could do it. You know, what I'm saying that's a long ponytail one, short one. I, I prefer the long ponytail one. It, it looks pretty good. Um, or any girl, to be honest with you. Um, also, I uh, turned off the control speakers because I don't want the speaker controlling going up when I'm talking and commentating. You know what I'm saying? It's annoying. Also, on top of this, though, I mute the music volume. So for all the, the anime Asian, you know, because this is basically kind of like an Asian game we're playing right now, which is Asian people make really fun games. Uh, shout out to Japan and China. Uh, but anyways, besides that, though, um, you know, uh, you know the music volume has to be muted i have to mute the um the music volume i know some of y'all are gonna be pissed off about that but hear me out i just don't want to get copyrighted i don't want to risk my channel of getting copyrighted over some bullshit because you know how youtube is you know, sometimes falsely copyrighting you copyright your channel for no damn reason music whatever and all that type of stuff this happened to me in the past of the uh of, of the walkthroughs i've done where i would have uh, settings to where like a like a like a streamer mode settings to where I turn off the streamer mode settings to just wait just just just, just in case that I can get away from the copyright music or whatever right I upload them right next thing you know it's copyright <laughs> and the music shit's been going on like th this this happened in in the, uh, my walkthrough I did with Life Strange Through Colors and many others because the the music the music is a copyright shit which I had no idea about that's why for safety of my channel if for you uh, and then for, for my safety of my channel, I'm going to just mute the music and all type of stuff. I know you guys can be disappointed, but I just don't want you know, to risk my channel getting terminated and all type of stuff. So I just want to point it out. I'm just going to, I'm going to say it for every walkthrough I do from here on out to make people who are new to this channel to understand. And if you still don't understand, you can say what you want to say in the comment section or if you still have a question about it. I just don't want to risk my, my channel getting terminated if you understand where I'm coming from. But anyways... Uh yeah, the sound music volume is gone. If like I said, other YouTubers gonna have their music volume and all type of stuff on, but I just don't want mine to be in the risk. So sorry, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Um, I think we adjust everything in the settings right here. I think I don't know about the sensitivity, whatever. There's this range mode, par guard parry, you can hold while sprinting, that's dodging, jumping, quick attack, stronger. Oh shit, this is a lot. Burst skills. Fire selected ammo. Oh shit, this game's gonna be interesting. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh uh, yeah. I can't wait. I can't wait. But uh, anyway, besides that though, you know what I'm saying? Um, it's gonna be a lot of shit I gotta go like understand completely when I play this game. All right. So anyway, besides that though, um, yeah, man. I mean, I lost my voice. Um, uh, shit. So yeah, man. I mean, that's pretty much it on everything I talked about. 
Uh, let's get to this Stellar Blade demo. And uh, make sure I leave a like, subscribe. Uh, like I said, let me know in the comments section down below. Are you guys are you guys excited for the Stellar Blade to come out? Um, just like I am. Uh, what are your thoughts on Stellar Blade, the demo, what you think they should change or whatever to make the game better? Um, you know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, I mean, that's pretty much it. You know what I'm saying? I really wish I was sponsored by like, Sony. Like, really, I really want that sponsorship, Sony. Please give me the sponsorship. Anyways, um, Stellar Blade uh, demo of the real game, just so you know. Anyways, um, let's get right to it. Transmitting final briefing. As of now, Airborne Squad 7 will exterminate the Alpha Nativas occupying District 3. Their objective is the capture Wait, what the hell? dispatchment of the Elder Nativa. Pods oh. entering atmosphere. Pods? Wait, wait, what the hell? Oh, shit. Oh, what the hell? Are we like the... Ar it's like he's like part of an army? The threshold has been surpassed. Activating shield. Oh shit. This look cool already. So I know for a fact we're going against aliens, right? It, so that means that there's going to be like an army. We're going to need like an army of soldiers to face off against the aliens. Yeah, at least it's a battlefield. Oh shit. Oh, they got a shield. They got a shield protector. Well, one just hit. Code red. Code red. Yeah, code red. I figured. These aliens came prepared. Shit. Oh man. <laughs> oh my god. Damn. Holy shit. All available drop pods will be ejected according to protocol B32. Protocol B32. Okay. I mean, shoot out the rockets and kill any hostiles nearby. Or not. Or, you know, or or maybe shoot, put, put down your soldiers, I'm assuming. I don't know. I guess protocol B2 means, you know, throw down your soldiers into the battle right there. Oh, shit. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, damn. Everyone's getting destroyed for all the pods. Oh, shit. And we're, damn, someone just hit us from the, uh, uh, the other pod just hit us. What the hell? Is that us? Is that Eve? Oh, she's malfunctioning. Yeah, 70 e e EP, no. yeah. No. Oh shit, yeah, she, she's malfunctioning. She's getting cooked, y'all. Yeah. Oh shit. Damn. Yep, these are pods. They had to. They had to pull them. They had to pull them from the ground to the sky to their ground up. They had to pull them from the sky to the ground. Pod landing complete. Yeah. Thank you. Moving physical shield. Opening hatch. Uh. Great. The hatch. How can she? How? She's stuck. Um. Uh, um. How do I get out? Brother, I'm dead. Or am I? Tacky. Ooh, tacky. Eve, are you all right? What's up? What's up, Tacky? How you this doing, girl? Whoa, hold on now. Take my hand. Can I take a test as well? Not explaining. <laughs> Joking. Pour out. Whoa, hold on, yo, 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 Sonny, Sonny, Sonny. I, I know what y'all were doing. Oh. Yeah, I know what y'all were doing. They know what they were doing. That's why everyone was hyped for this game. And so am I. Oh shit, that's a big old aliens right there. This way to the rendezvous. Star Sin. New mission. Yeah, okay, X for square a square for quick attack. <laughs> Get out of here. Okay, strong attack. Okay. Mm. Mm. Okay. You're on the guard. That means block, right? Mm. Mm. Come here. Oh, nice. I see you 
still have your combat senses. Great. Coordinates. Yeah. The rendezvous yeah. point is at two o'clock. Yeah, tacky. In front of us. Okay. So we still got to fight these aliens. Oh, damn. Look at these. Whoa. Michael Bay type shit. Oh, get out, get out. Ooh. That was close. Yeah, that was close, tacky. Come here. Careful of your jump. Uh, press X, jump. Okay, good. Say less. Like, can we talk? Hold on a second. Like, this is insane. Wait. I'm in the main menu. What the hell? <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on. Okay, so this is how it's going to be, huh? Oh, yeah, settings, store, uh, settings, and all that. Yeah, tacky. Tacky is a common officer, seven board squad. So, yeah, we're in the army, basically. The seven board squad gets obliterated by the, the, the Nazi, the, not, Nazi boss. I'm going to say aliens. Get blurry by the aliens while entering the Earth atmosphere. However, the mission is still to go. Tacky flies the agent. So I'm assuming we're gonna have plenty more characters that we're gonna be going along with while we play this E, right? So the so the not not to so that Nati by so Nate Nati by is it Nati by? I think it's Nati by the Nati by, which is the enemies, basically the aliens. Thornhead, yeah. Thorn head and all that combat stuff. Thorn hands not just yet. Be easy taking down. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I figured. Oh damn! <laughs> oh god! You fucking rip. Watch out! It's an unlisted nativa. Yeah. I'll uh -huh. this one. Yep. Oh shit! Hold on. Okay. Do it again. There we go. That's the parry thing. Okay. Watch out. There's more. Where at? Oh, right here? Come on. There we go. Oh. Okay. When you hit a parry, uh, right. when, you, when you hit an enemy a parry attack, the beta charge charge. So is the bait so the beta charge is basically the ones down there. Okay. So basically the beta charge is when you you have like a power up when you hold L like L1 and square you have like a like a charge right. thorn. Okay. Body frame. Yeah, it's, it's more functioning. It's first aid. Thank you. Thanks. Use potions, hold like potions. Okay, hold like potions, you potions immediately. This is the rechargeable dumber. And he stores a lot of HP. Okay, good to know. There's more of them. Okay. Pulse for rush. Oh. 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 Easy. Get off me. So you rush, you hold, you hold, hold it, uh, triangle to rush. Yeah, two white. Get the attack jump up on. Yup, parry. Yeah, you got time that parry. I need, I need to put my glass for this. Hold on a second. Let's get out of here before more of them show up. Yeah, hold on. Let me put on my glasses, baby. Hold on a second. Hold on. Hold on. Yeah, I got the parry shit. It's important. I love parrying when it comes to fighting games. It's important because you can like stagger the enemy you and then you hit them and you do more damage. All right. Say less. Moving by sprinting. Oh, all right, so you click down the sprint. Then why did the menu say we can hold down the circle sprint? Whatever. I don't know. Circle, I remember to dodge. That didn't make me want to scream. That did? Shit. Gosh, these explosions come out. Thank you, to, to Tushy. <laughs> That's what I was trying to do, not to move. Lord, see. This is crazy. That was close. Close. I nearly got hit three times. Good. Let's go. It never look, does look good. This big guy. Is that an alpha nativa? So Let's that's a big them. boy alien. That's a big boy alien. Oh, damn. 
It's fucking wow, that Michael Bay explosions. Tushy. Yeah, she's still malfunctioning still, but still can fight though. No, no. The squad's life signs. Yeah, they're all dead. Like the only two left. Yep. Damn. All the mass and tits are all gone. Jesus. I'm sorry. Eve. Eve, pull yourself together. I mean, she's trying. Taki. Listen to me. We haven't completed our mission. You know, I just realized on the Taki. Isn't that Let's Taki's like a chip that we have through. currently? <laughs> Her name's Understand? Taki, but like in a, a, other name form. Sorry. It's just, I, I just thought of that already. Gotta stand up, girl. Here we go. Oh, the big boy's not there yet, huh? Oh, here we go. Eve, are you ready? Ready when you are. Let's do this. Big boy, rise. I forgot. Oh, yep, one. Ah. ah. Got it. Oh, oh. <laughs> no, oh shit. Oh, no. I gotta be careful. Oh, no, no, that's, what, that's the instant. Get away. Get away, get away. Get this. Oh, yep. Dodge back. Here we go. So the beta, so the beta, uh, energy. Ah, damn. You got, yeah, your parry got, you got to try to challenge the parry a little bit quicker. Shit. Damn, the parry's kind of hard in this game. Damn. There we go. Got him. There we go. Yeah, the parry in this game, you gotta time this shit. Just like any other action adventure game. But he kicked his ass, though. Nice. That's nice. It wasn't an alpha, but it was a strong one. That was a, a big ass alien right there. Fought well, even better than during training. You were all together, but then. Yep, the aliens I... start to fuck up, and she's still malfunctioning. The damage to your body frame is serious. Yeah, it's really bad because she just came out of the sky and then got hit. We have to find the supply camp. God damn, that that hasn't tits. I cannot. Wait, Eve. Help! I hear something. The fuck! Eve! What? Oh! What is that? New challenge approach? Challenger approach? Eve, are you alright? No, she's clearly knocked out Tushy. Oh, Taki. Sorry, I say Tushy. Taki. Yeah, that's the new enemy. That's like the big boss or something like that. Oh shit. The claws. That's insane. The claws are ridiculous. Yeah, friend, it's me you want. I don't know about that. Yeah, quickly she won't hurt. No! Uh oh. 
Oh! Damn! Oh! Oh! She's about to get more combat. Fatality. Ass, though. Get out of here. She's dead. Ducky! Yep. There we go. <laughs> That's how you start the game. Well, Taki's not going to be in Stellar Blade 2, I can tell you that much. <laughs> I can't. What the fuck? Oh, man. That's This is insane. Let go. It's quiet. So who are you at now? Still, make sure to stay cautious. Who are you? It's where the Alpha and Atiba is. Alpha and Atiba. Yeah, it's that it's that alien that killed uh Taki. Unfortunately, he died. Wow, this is uh this is uh pretty interesting. I like this game so far. Just the parrying. You have to time your shit. The dodge is gonna be really important for me because I, if I can't pay my shit, I just got to dodge and just hope for the best. Now get ready. I'll be supporting with the drone. So what are we doing? Is the question. Supporting you with the drone. Like, hey, what are we doing now? Them high heels that she got on is crazy. So this must be eight oh seven. Eight oh seven. This was the final battlefield of civilization. Before the aliens took over, it was okay. Also known as a truly colossal city. Colossal city, this was called, okay. And it's called the Iodosum, so whatever. Sky. A strange sensation. It's called rain. This must be Earth's rain. Yes, there you go. We can admire the scenery <laughs> later. We have a job to do here. I mean, she's admiring the rain, dude. Oh my gosh! So, new ability: hold the button for view. Yet, yet the nun I'll slaughter her wipes out the Taki squad to make matters worse. I identify alien strikes without warning, leaving both Taki and Eve. Yeah. So basically, as time goes on, yeah. Basically, if a character dies. Or things go on with the character that's continuing. Basically, it'll start to narrate the character of what happened. Yeah, we saw Taki died, and this dude named Adam. That's a that's a white person name, okay? Adam Cole, baby. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm I love Adam Cole, but you know. Uh, anyways, besides that though, um, Adam is a scavenger from Ac Axon. He saved the Eve's life from an identified. Oh, so he's the one that saved her life from that that identified alien. So Eve, Eve did not trust him at first. I suggest that that he and Eve were together so they can arrive at the uh, ide ideal seven, you know, ideal seven. So basically, they're gonna try to do something to find the this big old alien that killed, um, that that killed Taki. So attacks, yeah, square. So strong attacks is triangles, weak attacks is. Where guard, yeah, hold down to decrease damage taken. You're still gonna take some damage while you're guarding too, as well. Keep that in mind. But I need to figure out the parrying part though too. Parrying is really important. Then rushing, holding triangle. Okay, beta skills. So beta energy. So the B stands for beta energy. So basically, I guess if you kill an enemy or whatever, somewhat you can like you know attain like an energy. Or, or like a kill like a like an alien or something like that. Or like if you if you do your parry like your parrying like time your parry correctly or kill an alien, you know like because I think this game is going to be like a skill tree like something like that. I think this is a skill tree, right? Yeah, the skill tree right here. Yeah, it's going to be something involved with the beta, the attack, survival, which is the health shit, and then something else. But nonetheless, though, 
I think there's gonna be some uh, something along the lines where we're gonna have like a ability to like you know, to like whenever we get kills attacks, whenever we get kills like from whatever we can like get uh when we get with uh whatever you know what I'm saying. So like for example, I think this is the uh, skill one, right? So basically attacks it says. It said recharge one beta energy, which is the one we need for like a special attack. So beta energy it basically means a special attack. That's what you need to reflect more damage towards, towards the enemies or the aliens, you want to call it. So basically with this one, it says recharge more beta energy when attacks land. I like the skill tree in this game, by the way. It's really cool. But I like this one. This I think we're going to need this one because I want that, that, that beta energy charge. It deals a lot of damage towards the enemies, uh, towards the uh, you know aliens, which is cool. Say leap down to assault any to FQ can only be used on enemies that are are in combat. So basically, we could like sneak sneak attack this enemy with this one. That's really cool. Um, this a this a whole this a dash shit a rush. So increase the dash dash and charge attack. Okay, so this a so this a dash attack. You know, rush attack. You hold down triangle and then you do like some combos with it you know so that's uh good pain rush oh you go you hold down you know you press triangle with that oh that's really good right there but i like i like the beta inch i prefer this one though so yeah adam save our ass so yeah speaking of ass y'all notice that 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 he's got a really good ass okay i'm done <laughs> i'm done because you look at this angle like Really? <laughs> anyways, um, anyways, so I'm guessing. Falling debris. Be carefully. Oh yeah. Uh, thanks for the heads up. Something is coming. Yeah, the the, the alien type enemy. They're common around. <laughs> yeah, I figured they were coming. <laughs> One pair. What? Okay, you gotta hold down. Okay, I just realized something. All right, all right, all right. I thought that you have to like, you know, tactically, you know, hold down to like parry and all type of stuff. You can also like, kind of like block, but you have to like, you know, it's like get the parry like kind of thing you want it. You have to hold down at the right time in order to get the parry in order to get the parry, you know. Um, attack, you know, a parry thing in order to like stun an enemy. So you can't just tap it. I can't tap L1 to in order to get it to go on. You have to hold down in order to like, like to get the like the block going along with the, along with the parry. This is the legion that was killed in the final war. Oh shit. Uh, do we need a passcode for this? Really? There's an encrypted code in the memory stick. It's a security code. A type of entry permit. Uh, yeah, I figured. Thank, thanks, Adam. <laughs> so we need to. We need to coat. We need to coat this shit. What I just do? Oh, is this the like the? Uh, so I press the middle button in the places button. So basically, this scans out things that that that's nearby. Okay, so like a objective thing we need to go to. Good. I need that shit because I'm tired of this puzzle shit that I had to go through. These walkthroughs I've been going through, they'd be annoying sometimes. All right, so scavenger, yeah. That, so it says the the another mission says scavenger Adam. Dials the Adam is asked for is that is that the halls of records go to the halls of records by the following the drone to control by that's controlled by Adam. So we gotta go to the halls of records in order to get where he he needs or something. I don't know. So yeah. Past codes. I think that's what we're probably gonna be needing to in order to go on, you know, type of stuff. Nearby, the aliens. These are me. So basically, these are small, small alien creatures that that doesn't mean much. The warriors, though, on the other hand, though, there's a there's a lot of them. Elite ones. Yeah, this elite one that takes a lot, 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 lot of attacks, you know, type shit. Okay, this is interesting. Yeah, we're gonna be we're gonna need this. Potions, yeah, I never heard about that. All right, so that's how I meant to press, you idiot. Uh, so this is what we need. Okay, I need to remember. Okay. Try entering the code. 
Yeah. All right. No. Did it work? Yeah, there we go. It worked. Yep. It worked. Building's collapsing. Yep. Because of the city's unstable terrain. You'll get used to it soon. Uh I won't get used to it. Swim fast. Yeah, okay, swim fast. Dive. Brother. I can tell like it's gonna be like some secrets or something like that that we might need to discover. Like this. Oh, you see this? <laughs> I told you, man. Whole items, whatever. Name element element elements. I don't know what they what they mean. Hold on, we're gonna go back up, see what they are. These items might be important to help out, you know, E to like uh upgrade whatever, so we might need to like you know use those that might be important and there might be an achievement to know get those that's if that's if this game does not have a hard difficulty if this game has hard difficulty in this game for plow trophy i ain't doing it no because i'm not trying to stress myself off the hard difficulty shit and get headaches yeah this is ain't nothing come on hold on Oh, ouch. Ah, do it again. There we go. Yeah, you gotta hold the parry. Camp in a place like this. Yeah, see, I see when I parry, every time you parry, I think I believe the beta energy will start going up and you start to use that for your special moves or whatever. Camps. A, or a place where you can save progress and you know, get some rest. You can achieve get to you achieve them by a team bunkers near near the camps. Sit down on chair, recover HPs. But you feel that the RT starts. I will be revived when it's available. Some will will we'll, we'll, we'll be revived when resting camp. So, okay, use the vending machine at the camp to purchase items. You can learn to train the skills through the okay. So we sit right here, activate the camp. You know what I'm saying? We, we could check out like the neck. We could have a song on here. Oh, okay, but I'm not good. I have a mute the whole music shit, so I'm not doing that for copyright reasons. There's a skill thing. You know, skill thing right here. Learn skills, change trees, um, and all that. You can select skills, whatever. Select a select the perfect dodge. Complete, complete, perfect dodge. When completely avoided enemy attack upon himself, like successful dodging, press triangle to perform additional. T oh, perfect dodge. We definitely need that. I could just perfectly dodge away, because I do be dodging a lot when it comes to adventures and action adventures games, though too. But I'll also be parrying too as well, because I like parrying. Because it stuns an enemy, you just swing back. Go back and dodge and swing back, you know, shing shing type shit. You know what I'm saying? And also, you can enter trade into this game too, as well. Which, uh, that's pretty awesome. <laughs> I think you can. You can enter train in this game, can't you? Yeah, you can enter train in this game. That's really cool. Yeah. Select, a, select this a skill at a college train that you also try out. What do you haven't learned yet? If you're not used to combat, try to increase the, the proficiency with the game. Yeah. Hold on. Yep. There we go. There we go. Yep. Perfect dodge. Oh yeah, this is gonna be huge. Oh yeah. I need that. Do it again. Yeah, I need that. Okay, ouch. Yeah, this is gonna be huge. I need that. I'll dodge a lot in, in terms of the pad game. Hold on. Try to do it again. Oh yeah, this is perfect.
There we go. And then you just like do a dodge. Okay, hold on. Ouch, hold on. Wait a second. Yep. Yeah, this is this is really good. You got yo shit. You got really gotta be like okay. Okay. Yeah, this is you. Yeah, one more time, one more time. Yep, here we go. Come on, I got, I got to tap it. Yeah, you gotta be, you gotta be like really fast. And this is another one too as well, the cannon. Oh damn. So this the this the strike one. This the shockwave one. Yeah, this is a shockwave one. Oh man, so that's multiples of those. Yeah, that. That's that's huge. Oh yeah, the parrying and guarding is gonna be really, really interesting. Cause uh, cause you can parry if you want to, but oh shit! Oh damn! So basically, hold on. So the yellow marks on the on the you see the yellow little dot marks? Those are the parry like like you know stunt parry things. Like if you pair if you pair them depending on what the stun mark is, you can stun them a lot. Those are the little yellow things are, and the and the um and the little light little blue bar thing that's the shield. That's crazy. Yup, do it at the end, then you execute. Oh, that's awesome. That's pretty cool too. That's really awesome. That's awesome. You could train, do all type of shit. That remind me of the Delman Cry type of shit when you could go in and train and all type of stuff to learn new moves. Yeah, I like that. I like what they did. That's pretty cool. That's gonna be very interesting to what you know new moves we have or things that we need to work on. Cause I do need to work on the parrying. I need to work on the dodging. I need to get those down. Why not rest for a minute? Yeah. Resting is part of any mission. Dude, I rest already. Oh wait, I gotta go over right here to rest. So yeah, it's very interesting. Yep, I think this is what Adam save her. What's wrong? The dude was dead already. Uh, it's nothing. Not something. <laughs> Obviously. From here on, you have to stay alert, Eve. I mean, she was kind of doing that, you know. All right, so we got heals up. I'm assuming the S S H thing is the shields. Yeah, the okay. So the S H means shield, H P means bars, the B E means the energy, which is like the our like our big like special move attacks. Yeah, the, just the shield shit. Yeah, S H is the shields. I just realized that. So yeah. Actually, assist. You can use actually assist to function story mod, story lines, politics, so that does slow it down. Enemies will form the power attacks before counter will be displayed on screen. Yeah. Okay. Got 
There we go. Damn. Damn, that's really cool. It's one of the Legion's old supply boxes. Do you think there's anything useful? Land potions. Select the desired the potions. Well, it's Legion, so compatibility shouldn't be an issue. Yeah, it should. Sure to take everything. Should be an issue. <laughs> okay, so what new potions we got here? We have, of course, it restores the HP potions. Continuously restore HP potions. That's that one. Instantly, so this is the instantly like all magic restores all your all your uh, potions. So some of it continuously and all of it. So okay, so there's got to be like a potion that we use for like for the BE e energy was the beta energy we used for like like our tactical. Dave, be you know, careful. You our tactical, you know, enemy, you, fall, um, it's over. you know, tactical abilities. Watch out, fuck up. I'm glad it's helping me. I'm glad it's helping me, you know, basically understanding what these bars are. I go over here. What is this? Let me go up here and see what that was. This oh, so it's uh, another thing to get this. There's another supply box over here. Yeah. Did someone forget to retrieve this? I'm sure there are more supply boxes. It'll help us survive. Use as crafting so, materials. Look carefully. Yeah, use as crafting materials and stuff like that. Okay. Does that uh hold on? I'm, I'm trying to think. Does that help us a lot with something? No, there's just another creature manual. Yeah, dodge. Obviously, we know that. Exploration camp. Yeah, we know that. Yeah, there's gonna be a lot of shit that we need to explore. Can't jump down. It's gonna be so interesting. First triangle use the air attack. Okay. Oh damn, that's fucking sick. <laughs> and now, and the SP would about seventy-seven percent. It means that we can like have a skill point up and like upgrading, balancing, maintaining balance of stance, balance of display below. Yeah, yeah, balance. balance. You can knock enemies off the balance by performing perfect parry attacks. Enemies that are completely off balance can become groggy and use retribution to deal massive damage. Yeah, so okay, so that's balance. So those little yellow dot means balance. So basically, if you perform like at least about a couple, you know, parries attacks, they'll get stunned to the point where you can get like execute them. Come on, do it. Okay, you gotta time your parry. Like I said, this like, this game may easily become the parry. I mean, yeah, yeah, you gotta time it. Yeah, see. See, I blocked it, but you gotta time your parry. There we go. It's time you parry you. Just like that. Yeah, just like that. Skill points, uh, which is like 84%. Yeah, parry is important because not only it, it helps out with your uh it helps out with your um you know your bear, it helps you out, you know, increase your bear energy, but also it helps you out, you know, you know, to you know destroy enemies every time you know. Oh yeah. Let's try. Come on. Yup, dead. There we go. Bam. That enemy had like three balance, the dot, the little dot balance little things. I parried it three times, stun that enemy, and then boom. Ass kill him, just like that. Fully kills the enemy. Yeah, you love to see it. It's pretty cool. Gear, gear's equipment to improve e e e e e uh, combat abilities. You can equip gear in the gear socket. Okay, so we picked up a gear. Use this materials close up. Let me see. So equipment. Gear. So I guess there's um there's equipment for you can use to for Eve to for Eve to like make her better or whatever type type stuff. And then you use her accessory, you know, type stuff with her suits. You can help her out to become better. 
No, basically, it's that's the reason you can explore throughout this game. I'm guessing that the more you, you find Gears of E, the more better it can possibly be, you know, to help out Eve's durability type shit, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, Gears play a huge factor to help out Eve, you know, fight more better type shit. Like, dead ass. Like, the ones I have, uh, I don't know if it's combat gear. It says combat gear, X chance gear, so like combo attacks power is level level two level two or higher, increased by forty percent. Increased attack powers or combos, attacks like level two or higher. So this helps out with the gear gear and all that. Now what does it look like though? Hold on. I mean combat chance gear, but okay. What does it look like, though? I don't understand. <laughs> I get what, what it looks like, though. Is it because she has a tie on her? Hold on. Let me see. I took it off. Okay, I put it on. I guess that that's helped her with her stuff, I guess. I don't know. So many things. Pretty interesting. All right. Well, looks like we attacked those enemies. Looks like they're they're done. All right. So what else? Scans. Uh, to have a drone sit around the area, locating places you can hang. Yeah. I figure. Yeah. The, yeah. The city's in a similar state. By comparison, this city is looking pretty good. After the colony extinction, most places were nothing but dust. Yeah, like this place. Nothing but dust. Yeah, that's not good, too. Yeah, flint. yeah parrying, dodging, comboing is going to be like a key thing. Wait, there's a fusion cell. But right Let's here? Open the car's hood. Oh, well, I already did that earlier ago. I mean, it, the fusion cells helps out. Oh, surprise. At least the fusion cell's intact. Yeah, it helps out. It, it's a, like like gives her, you know, energy. I guess so? it's a high energy compression battery. Yeah. Thanks to that, Earth's night isn't dark yet. It's oh, yeah. It's true. the previous generation of the Infinity Cell. Yeah. Be sure to keep that. It's very valuable and important. You might you need you might need that Eve. Use it to activate views and drives. So, okay, so fusion cells to activate fusion drives. Awesome, good to know. Pretty good to know there's enemies here, so, uh, yeah, I figured. I figured the enemy was right there. I just didn't pay attention. Yeah, there's a lot to explore here. Out of here. Skill point. I got one skill point. Pretty good. Like this is like that bad. I damn. This is pretty good. Train runner. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. There's a code to in order to get these uh these items. You gotta be kidding me. Wow. Wait, hold on. Human. Wait a second. The memory sticks fried. Mean meaning it's it doesn't matter. Great. Hold on, let me see. So it doesn't matter, huh? But yeah, because we know about the enemy. That's the octopus alien. I'm gonna call him that. Here it's gonna be important. You know, that's gonna be for exploration, scanning, balancing, that's the uh the things you need to need to do to parry someone's attacks, you know, to stun them a bit more. Good to know. Good to absolutely freaking know. Man, this demo, I ain't gonna lie. I've seen demos to be like this long enough, but not as long as as this as as I thought it tend to be. Explorations, everything else. I like demos like this. It's pretty cool. 
and I cannot open it. Great. <laughs> I cannot open it. Once one more. Uh huh. Damn. It's a trap. Yeah. Trying to beat their asses. Let's do this thing. Uh huh. Crap. Oh, oh come on. Oh, come on, I blocked that. Come on. No. That, that's a parry, right? Yeah, that was a parry. Yeah, that was a parry attack. That was, that was pretty awesome. You gotta be kidding me, right? Ah, of course. Okay, ouch. Yeah, that's the blow. Yeah, blow delivery. So yeah, when you see the little shiny little thing going on the enemy's head, that's the blow. You cannot parry nor uh, do anything. Ah, damn. There we go. Damn. We're in the clear. Where do we go now? Ooh, that's yeah. This way. Enemies can do combos there too as well. And you got a parry doing on. this and that, knowing with the dodging. That's going. That's going to be crazy. But uh, no less though. I mean, this is a demo right here. I'll stop right here uh, for more uh, Stable Blaze. So thank you for watching. Do like, subscribe, and as always, take care. I'm out. Peace. To the ones that told me to quit, look at me now. Oh.